This is the week from Al Jazeera Noan. Welcome. The President of the Republic of Majid Tabun ordered Sunday at a cabinet meeting to prepare for partial local elections in the municipalities where it was not possible to elect popular councils to run, to run them. In the localities of November 27, 2021, due to the, re, to the absence of qualified candidates to enter the elections, or for all the reasons, the cabinet meeting dealt with two draft laws related to the prevention of corruption and the modalities of exercising the union right and presentations regarding the mechanisms for appointment or appointing administrators in municipalities in which it was not possible to hold local elections as well as following up on the implementation of regulations for transferring confiscated property to the commercial public sector. The President of the Republic then officially appointed the Inspector General of State and Local Authorities at the Presidency of the Republic, followed by the presentation of the Prime Minister and the Minister of Finance to the outcome of the of the government's activity in the last two weeks. On the same meeting, the President of the Republic ordered the opening of a maritime line with the Islamic Republic of Mauritania as soon as possible. The Minister of National Education, Abdel Hakim Blahabad, revealed that the inclusion of the English language and all foreign languages in the school environment in primary education requires careful preparation in accordance with necessary educational and organizational stations. Regarding the approved foreign language, the Minister stressed that the Ministry of Education is working to enable pop or pupils to master at least two foreign languages in order to open up around the world as stipulated in the Directive Law for Education. The Minister is also working hard to upgrade the English language, which is listed starting from the first year of intermediate school. The Minister pointed out that the English language curriculum, which requires a feature renewal to leave the secondary stage, must be considered with complies with the requirements of the university's needs in terms of language competencies to be projected of the mari or prim primary educational or educational stage. And on Monday, the President of the Republic, Abdel Majid Tabun, received the flagpole of the Arab Cup from the personal representative of the Emir of the State of Qatar, Jassim bin Hamad al-Thani, representative of the Emir of the State of Qatar, presented the flagpole of the Arab Cup to President Abdel Majid Tabun. The flagpole of the Arab Cup also bore the logo of this Arab Championship and the colors of the Algerian national flag. This comes during the reception on Monday by the President of the Republic of the personal representative of the Emir of the state of Qatar, Jassim bin Hamad al Thani, it is not worthy that the national team for the locals who won the Arab Championship Cup 2021, which was held recently in the Qatari capital, Doha. And on Tuesday, Minister of Energy and Mines Mohamed Argeb participated in the work of the 24th ministerial meeting of the countries of the OPEC Plus Group, which includes 23 member countries of the organization and 10 countries outside it. According to a statement by the ministry during this meeting, the countries of the group decided to confirm the adjustment plan that was identified in the 19th ministerial meeting, which provides for an world increase in the volume of oil production every month. The 24th meeting agreed to increase monthly production by 400,000 barrels per day for the month of February 2022, when Algeria's production will reach 982,000 barrels per day, based on this increase, until the next meeting is held on February 2nd. The President of the Republic on Wednesday chaired an ex extraordinary meeting of the Supreme Security Council, which dealt with the general situation in the country. The meeting was attended by the Prime Minister, Minister of Finance, Ayman bin Abdurrahman, Chief of Staff of the People's National Army, Lieutenant General Saeed Shingriha. The meeting was also attended by Minister of Foreign Affairs, Amtal Amamra, Minister of Interior, Kamil Biljoud, Minister of Industry, Hafiz, or Keeper of the Seas, and Abdul Rashid Tabi. The meeting also took place in the presence of the Director General of National Security, the Commander of the Gendarmerie and the leaders of security services. On Thursday, the President of the Republic, Majid Tabun, signed a presidential decree that includes the composition, organization and functioning or functioning of the Supreme Security Council. The Supreme Security Council meets upon a summons from the President of the Republic in an ordinary session whenever necessary to decide on every issue related to national security that has an internal or external dimension to the country or in an exceptional session to decide on the announcement and termination of cases.
The Minister of Industry, Ahmed Zaghdar, paid a certain visit to the public institution Mahrousa for the manufacture of edible oils, where he inspected the various units of the table oil production plant in this establishment, which was re recently restarted after a hiatus of more than two years. During this visit, Zaghdar reviewed the production quantities of this factory, estimated at 130 tons per day, and how to supply the market with this substance. The minister gave instructions to raise the pace of work to include weekly holidays in order to meet the huge demand for table oil in recent times. He also stressed the need to complete the second production line project as soon as possible. This will allow to raise the total production capacity to 400 tons per day. It should be mentioned that the institution in Mahrousa is one of the branches of the Gurdiv public complex for food industries after it was transferred to the public, commercial and industrial sector within the framework of recovering the confiscated properties of the legal and natural persons who are being pursued by the judiciary final judicial rulings were issued against them as well as an implementation of the directives of the President of the Republic and the government's plan of action to re-establish all suspended institutions. An executive decree was issued in the latest issue of the official gazette number 99, including the creation of the vaccination permit. It is obligatory to submit it when entering or leaving the national territory as well, as when entering spaces, places and buildings of collective use or that receive the public. On Friday, the Ministry of Commerce decided to prevent the sale of table oil to minors. Speculators were discovered using children to acquire oil in large numbers for a fee. The same source revealed that the Ministry of Commerce will apply the speculation law to violators if it is proven that they participated in these operations. And now we close this number with sports sector where the FAF president Shafuddin Amara sent a message to... Cameroon, ahead of the start of the biggest football within on the African continent, the Algerian Football Federation, in the name of its president, Shafuddin Amara, and members of the federal office, expressed their best wishes for the success of this session and also wished success for the organi organizing country, Cameroon. This was the most important harvest of the week. I look forward to see you next week.